but there is a pretty big storm near me so internet has been kind of spotty but i've been working on it and i think we're finally back so today we'll be soloing the red worm hopefully while fighting through the servers and maybe even my internet so hopefully we can get it done oh uh, let me make sure that we're live first step in doing all this where's the stream not there there it is that's what we're looking for what's up legendary what's up mario nick cooler zero j chubby martin crema nasir robert what's up guys how's it going we get another shot at the red worm today We'll see if uh, the game will actually allow us to fight them this time. Round two. What's up, Imagine? What's up, Tango? Apocalypse? Heisenberg? What's up, Hyper? Flynn? What's up, Femboy? Yeah, I hope they don't crash either. What's going on, Cheesy? Hated? Sussy? What's up, guys? Let me set the game real quick. Modern... Why does Modern Warfare 3 never show up for me? It's always the old Modern Warfare 3, whatever. Don't jinx it and it won't happen. Listen, I can never escape a jinx. It'll always be there. But I'm going to set up a tombstone before we uh, attempt to fight him again. Oh, Hyper with 11 months. Thank you, Hyper. Appreciate you. Thanks for supporting the channel. Oh, and Cheesy with the 5. Thank you, Cheesy. Dang, very generous. Appreciate you guys. Thank you, Hyper, and thank you, Cheesy. It means a lot, guys. All right, let's 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 uh, hurry up and set up this tombstone so we can see if it'll let us fight him. Sorry, Martin. I'm trying to do it solo. How's the multiplayer campus going? Honestly, I haven't really worked on him in a bit. I have been playing a bit of ranked. I've been trying to get, like close to one of the milestones so that way i can make a video on it because i don't want to just make a video of like me playing i might end up doing it anyways if i'm not close enough but i i, I kind of want to like unlock something during it you know what's up fives almost plat three and warzone rank solo queuing hey that's pretty good for solo queuing i've been solo queuing a lot and just multiplayer ranked and i'm silver three right now i'm almost to gold but it's a struggle solo queuing, man. It's tough. Oh, happy belated birthday, Jordy. What up, Snowy? Remember to shoot straight up on the worm? I'll try. We gotta get there first. No, I'm good, Apocalypse. I still got enough items to do it. Like, I, I got... I still have, like, three VR11s and a few Legendary Aether tools. It's just all about us, like, the game still working by the time we get into the fight. Oh, Truffles with a 10. Thank you, Truffles. Appreciate you. Here's to a crash-free session. I hope so, dude. Thank you, man. It means a lot. Thank you for supporting. Appreciate you guys. That's what, that's what we'll be trying to do, nose hair. And am I even saying that right, Truffles? Trellfaz. Trel, what about that? I can't read. But that ain't anything new. A happy early birthday, Hyper. Any advice for round 100 on D-Machine? Go grab the M79, PhD, Ring of Fire, and have a chopper gunner with you because if i found that i crash less or have the less chance of crashing using a chopper gunner over like um a cruise missile and just try to learn how to like stay alive up there and how to time your ring of fires in penthouse that's the best way to do it that's my favorite uh high round grinding spot Appreciate you watching this here. Oh, and Cheesy with another five. Damn, Cheesy. Thank you, dude. Appreciate you, man. I'm crazy today. It means a lot. Out here gifting to the people. Is 
Okay. Um, let's immediately go for. I kind of want to go for the tier three cargo, but I don't have a self revive. I'm using a a dummy class or a dummy operator that don't got nothing on them. I'll just go for this one. We'll play it safe. I'll do like one or two cargos till I got um either a pack two crystal or something or a few self revives, and then we can just do bounties. I know cargos aren't the, the most fun thing to watch, but they're the safest way to make money. What's up, Tyler? Is the ray gun good? I did get buffed, but I have not used it since, like, the Season 2 update came out. And that's when PhD was still broken. Where it, like, you, you would still do self-damage to, like, while using the ray gun. So I haven't really tried it out since then. But it's a, it's a bit better, but in this game it hasn't really been too strong. What's up, hated? What's my next sub goal? What's a what's a fun number within 200? 226. That'd be cool. Or 222. That'd be hype. Hey, thank you for watching, Dally. Appreciate you, man. What's up, Mercury? Oh, uh, maybe... Maybe nose hair. I think I might want to try to do, like... I want to do, like, a challenge series or something on this game, but I don't know what challenges you can really do in it besides, like, zero to hero. Because it'll be, like, go kill the red worm with, like... I don't know, someone will tell me to do it with like a pistol, no attachments, no upgrades, and it's like impossible to do. Because it's different than like Cold War or something where I can like try to get to round 100 with like a bad setup or, you know, do something crazy. Next sub goal is 420 million, that'd be insane. You imagine? Hey, don't be doing that, Finn. Call her back. The stream will still be here. Oh yeah, zero. I'm hoping that next year's game is as close to Cold War as we can get. That's the dream. Or I guess this year's game. The next COD year. Self revive, thank you. I'll take that and I'll just stow these for right now. Um, I don't know if I can take out a tier two bounty with a pack one MCW, especially if it's a disciple. Yeah, fuck it. We might as well try. We just got a, a rare Aether tool. It should help. Let's throw that on our gun. Grab that. You know, Arby's kids menu right in front of the Red Worm. Alright, look. We're about to get into another food discussion. Our, our famous food discussions we have here. But I always see people hating on Arby's, and I don't think Arby's is bad at all. Roast beef, you know, it's it's a little bit weird for a fast food chain, I know. But it's kind of good. On top of that, I think they probably got the best fries in fast food. If not the best, then one of the best. On top of that, Arby's sauce hits. Not horsey sauce. I don't fuck with horsey sauce. That ain't for my palate. But the Arby sauce, that's kind of like a barbecue sauce, is gas. And I got turnovers. Like a, a nice cherry turnover. Come on. Not sponsored, by the way, but Arby's be getting hate. Definitely underrated, Cooler. I'm with you. Taco Bell over Arby's. I would agree if Taco Bell didn't change their menu every six months and remove the one item I get every time. 
I only get the, like the Chipotle chicken griller, which they changed to like the Chipotle chicken wrap and then just completely removed it at the start of the new year. I fuck with Taco Bell. They got like the Cinnabon delights. They got the, the Baja blast, you know, everything that'll make me shit real hard. And I'm not just saying that because everyone's like, oh, Taco Bell gives me diarrhea. No, I, I picked the worst things to eat there and I know that it will hurt like my stomach won't agree with, but I do it because they're tasty. But why do they got to get rid of the one thing I get there every time? Who's still eating Long John Silvers? I'm, I think I've been there once in my life and never been there again. They got to have like some sort of like cult fan base. I, I was watching like a critical stream like a, a bit ago. It had to have been like a, a few months ago where he was going on the same tangent about Long John Silvers. And by the end of it, he was calling it like LJS. Like he, he's like, there's no way y'all are abbreviating Long John Silvers. And then by the time the stream was like towards the end, he was he was deep in the lore. Arby's is bomb, but the poop after is nuts. Yeah. They'd be fucking you up. To be honest, though, fast food gone downhill, like, fast. It's kind of crazy. Shit is expensive. Still kind of slow. Not fast. And the quality is just getting worse. Might as well make that shit myself. Oh, blast is gas. Mountain Dew is just gas in general. I don't know how they do it, but almost all their flavors they make are good. Even like, what was it last year they came out with like the flaming hot one? And I didn't even, I didn't mind it. Kind of felt like I was gonna get like acid reflex from it, but it wasn't nearly as bad as I thought it was gonna be. It was actually kind of good. Hey, shit, you demon. The devil be like. Damn, this thing's got some fucking ammo. That too, Golden. I'm I'm fully behind Little Caesars. I tell you what. Especially as a, a Michigan man. You can't beat a $5 pizza. That's the one place that hasn't really changed their prices like at all. And people be like, oh, this is, this is such shit pizza. You, I'd rather eat cardboard. Shut up. Go eat caviar, you pompous bitch. Little Caesars is gas. Crazy bread? Forget about it. I was at the Wendy's. Yeah. Th oh, that that's what I was trying to lead into, but my brain don't work so good. The Wendy's like surge charging is the dumbest shit I've ever seen in my life. I'm glad that they decided they're not doing it, but them testing the waters on that like publicly is just insulting because if they did it and it even works slightly, every single fast food chain is doing it. And that would just be the end of America. There would be famine. There would be war. Culver's is hit and miss for you? Honestly, I I mean, I'm, I'm going to say this like I don't do this at every restaurant or like every place, but I only get like the one thing when I go to Culver's and that's like a chicken sandwich. Pretty gas most of the time. Pretty good quality most of the time for me. I fuck with Culver's. I don't go very often though. It's like once in every like it's three, four months. Kind of nice though. Oh, no spice with the eight months. Thank you, no spice. Appreciate you, dude. Let's go, Butt Clan. Hell yeah, brother. Appreciate you, no spice. Like Little Caesars more than Domino's. I never had Don Domino's until I like moved here. And it's pretty good. Like, I still... When I'm trying to, like, treat myself a bit, I'll get Domino's, but... When I want Old Reliable, I'm getting Little Caesars. Because when I'd have my friends over for football, we're either getting Domino's or Little Caesars. Both are gas. I like them both. 
top five food places. Okay, this is in no particular order. I'm just going to say what comes to mind. I fuck with Panda Express. I fuck with Chick-fil-A. I fuck with... I don't know. I like B-dubs, but I wouldn't really put them in my top five because they're very inconsistent. A lot of the time when I'm like getting wings, like I, I never really like eat in the restaurant. I always get like takeout or have it like delivered or something. I just don't like, you know, eating out. Like being in places and eating. I'd just rather be at home and like watch something like, like a little iPad kid. But every time I get wings, they are so like criminally under sauced. They're either like perfectly sauced and it's a good time or criminally under under sauced. And it's like, what the fuck did I get these for then? You know? I'll work on it, Z. I'll work on it. About Costco? I haven't really ate at Costco in like a long time. But they also have like props to them. They haven't really changed their prices. He literally said he'll he'll kill somebody if they ever like change the the pizza price or the hot dog price, whichever one it was. And that's respect, because they already fucking make a killing off their membership fees, like losing profit on a, a hot dog or a pizza ain't gonna hurt them at all. Appreciate a rock. Oh, White Castle is good as fuck, too. I like White Castle. That's also one that's shitted on. But I'm not a huge burger person. I mean, this is probably going to sp speak volumes about what I'm about to say. But I'm not the biggest burger fan. Like, I'll have one here or there, but I'm not like, oh, man, I need a burger. But I really fuck with White Castle sliders. And I'll have, like, a McDouble here and there. So that probably tells you a lot about, uh, I don't know, my, my burger eating habits, I guess. Because when I was growing up, I, we weren't really, like, eating, like, you know, some well-made, like, quality burgers all the time. I was raised on, like, fast food, banquet, frozen TV dinners, and whatever the hell we could put together at home. White Castle is a dream. Especially those chicken O's, dude. I put them on my fingers and I go, eat them. And you take the White Castles. You know what you do with them when you're done? You put the boxes together. Nice and neat. Clean, dude. Have a kebab over a burger. I haven't... Mm, have I had a kebab? Oh shit, this is the fortress. I'm just so used to this not being a fortress anymore. Holy shit, I almost died. Sitting here thinking about kebabs. Did a bounty spawn in there? That's fucked up. <laughs> That's fucked up. They almost led me to my death. But I haven't had a kebab in like a long time, I don't think. I think I'd probably pick a kebab over uh over a burger. Depending on if if it's made for me or not. But if I gotta make it, it's a different story. I'm very lazy when it comes to doing things outside of YouTube. Best seasonal tree is a shamrock shake. It is pretty good. I fuck with a, a shamrock shake. The train's going by. I don't know if you guys can hear the horn. KFC better than Popeyes? Eh, debatable. There's some stuff I like better about Popeyes. I feel like KFC definitely has better, like, customer service. Because every time I go to a Popeyes, it's like I'm either waiting there for 45 minutes or, like, some shit's wrong. They're out of something. There's always something there, but when I get the food, I'm in heaven. A nice Popeye's chicken sandwich is so good. They have really good fries, too. KFC's decent. You know what you're getting with KFC. I won't complain with KFC. I really fuck with, uh, you know, their, their breading. 
11 herbs and spices or whatever. But that's also something that will give me the shits. KFC Pot Pie is the only thing they have that's a 10 out of 10. I really like the famous bills, but apparently they don't even have like popcorn chicken there anymore. So instead of the popcorn chicken in the famous bowl, they just have like chicken nuggets in it. And I haven't had it yet with that, but optically, you know, in my, in my mind's eye, that looks and sounds like trash. So I used to just fuck up a famous bowl. Devour that. Yeah, this should be the contract right here. Spawn in my reward, please. There it is. Um, I can drop that. Throw that in there. And we're good. Yeah, we've been talking about food this whole time, Lego. Somebody brought up one thing about food and I've been on a tangent for the last 20 minutes. We've just been talking about the, the current state of fast food. Popeye's better chicken, true. There's a good contract nearby, I guess I'll do this. And then we'll deliver that all the way towards uh, that bounty. Some Poyos Hermanos. I want to fucking... I, I want to go to New Mexico and just go to every Breaking Bad Better Call Saul location. I'll, I will turn Twisters upside down. They have Wawa in Michigan? No, I don't think so. But I've been to a few when I've been down south. They're pretty good. A gold MCU? MCW? What the fuck did I say MCU for? Jeez. I even watched them movies. Get the fuck away from me, zombie. Get the fuck away. There we go. That's what we like to see. All that extra damage with these shitty attachments. I wish we could reroll attachments in this, like in Cold War. Give me an armor stand. Oh, that's what I was grabbing. I get so sidetracked so easily. Yeah, Reloaded does come out in a week. Dave's Hot Chicken is better. And endorsed by Drake. I ain't gonna eat somewhere because Drake decides. I've never had Dave's Hot Chicken. I am a chicken connoisseur. I fuck with, I fuck with chicken. So I'm down to try anywhere that's got it. I didn't even get the money from that register. Excited for the new Pokemon game next year? I hope that they can build off of what they did with Legends Arceus. Because I feel like the entire Pokemon community when they played that was so surprised by it actually being like a really good game and it being like the groundwork for kind of what people have been asking for for Pokemon in a long time. For the longest time. I don't... I don't know. I, I'm cautiously optimistic. I'll say that. Because no matter what, I'm gonna basically get like every Pokemon game and I'm gonna play it. Because they just got, they got me trapped. I'm a, I'm a whore for Pokemon. But the with with the where the Switch's hardware is at, where it's just so bad, and just how Game Freak has not really tried to innovate up until Legends Arceus. And they've just done the same shit in the bare minimum every year. I don't know. Yeah, Mega Evolution is going to be back for it. I hope there's some cool new Megas. But a lot of people are saying that since the release date's in 2025, and it's rumored that the Switch 2 is coming out in 2025, that it'll actually be good and it'll be on good hardware, but I doubt it, dude. Nintendo makes really good games. Like, they're one of the more consistent gaming companies out there. But they got so much other shit backwards. Their online services are always terrible. 
And, you know, the Switch is cool being, like, portable and you can, you know, play it on your TV and everything, but technology's caught up. I can, I can play Elden Ring on my Steam Deck. Catch up. Catch up, Nintendo. Please. And now Nintendo's just going after, like, Yuzu, the, the Switch emulator. Trying to take out, like, people using it on their Steam Deck or stop people from doing that. Zaxby's is better? I haven't had Zaxby's, but I, I'd love to try it. Everyone says that Zax sauce is good or, or whatever it's called. Mega Ditto. I'm I'm so down for a Mega Ditto. Oh, wait, is that a hidden cache? Hold on. There's got to be some goodies right here. I don't even know what it would change for Mega Ditto, but I feel like it would be hilarious. Oh, you know what it should do? Mega Ditto for double battles, it combines into both the Pokemon on the field. Uh, it's like your enemy's Pokemon. And it just looks disgusting. That's what we need. That's how we do a legendary. From food to Pokemon so fast. Yeah, it was that was a, a quick turn. Elden Ring DLC stream? I still need to finish Elden Ring. I think I just got to like, um... Like, when I stopped playing it, I was at, like, the... I don't remember the, what the area is called, but it's, like, the the giants of the sky or something like that. So, I think... Now, no promises. But if I do stream some other games outside of COD, it'll probably be on Twitch. Maybe on YouTube, I don't know, we'll see. But I do want to beat the game before we go into, like, the DLC comes out. I remember the last boss I was on. I think I just got to that area up there and there was like a dragon in my way. And then I kind of stopped playing for a bit. And when I stopped doing something and it's out of my routine, then it's hard for me to get back into it. So I just haven't gone back, but now I want to. Same with like Dark Souls 3. I was playing that for a bit and then Liza P came out. And then I never finished Dark Souls 3 and then I never finished Liza P. I just like start games and then... Don't finish them. I don't know why. Because I fuck with those games. Same with uh, like Resident Evil 4. The remake when that came out. I was playing that for a bit and I never beat it. I just need to have like a dedicated day. Where I just go through and like stream and play all these games. Give me some uh, reason to get them done. You guys can hold me accountable. Hold my, my feet to the fire so to speak. Where the fuck did my car go? Did my shit get jacked? Oh, I didn't even take a car. Jeez. I flew here. I took Air Aether. Cold War Zombies or Modern Warfare Zombies? I don't even think they're comparable. Unless you're comparing Outbreak to this. Which, I would take this over Outbreak. I would get so bored playing Outbreak. Outside of, like, doing the Easter Egg or whatever. But this, I, I have... I think I have 10, maybe 11 days of game time just on zombies in this game i like it a lot it is super short i'm pretty i'm pretty far in it i don't remember like the very last thing i did but i know uh, spoiler alert i mean this game's i don't even know how old like it's got a fucking remake but i fought the like the fish in the lake and i beat that and i don't remember what i was doing after that it's been a while course. I'm to the first 25 J monies. We don't talk about them. All 25 absorbed into me. That'd be sweet. We clearly didn't absorb any brains, though. Actually, we probably did. That's probably why I'm so dumb. I got 25 of my own brains in here.
Where's AI money? I'm AI with the breeze. I don't know if I'd want to make an AI version of myself. This is weird. Unless I can do like shit outside of YouTube for me. Like I can go to the store. Make me some food. Thanks ears. I need all the, the luck I can get. How you feel about Batman's no kill rule? That guy's just a psychopath. Let's be real. Like everyone always makes the joke that you know Batman will beat somebody within an inch of their life for like having a gram of weed on him. Like he'll like completely paralyze somebody, but he's honorable because he didn't kill him. Like he'll drop him off a roof, and they'll fall just right to where just a few of their like you know their L5 and their L6 breaks, but they survive. Be real, Batman. Just kill people, dude. Get it over with. He's turning people into vegetables. And honestly, I've said this before too, so... This ain't, this ain't nothing new. This ain't a new take. But the most interesting about thing about Batman is his villains. Batman kind of boring. Kind of a <laughs> superhero. Not gonna lie. Like, I don't really care about any of Batman's, like, story or lore, really. I think his villains make the, the fights and everything cool. Start a live stream of just watching cartoons. Get sniped by the, the DA, DMCA marksman. If I could, like, sit and watch anything on stream, it would be, like, Breaking Bad or Better Call Saul. I've seen those shows, like, over 20 times. I'd just be on here, like, quoting them. Like, word for word as the show's going. Actually, I haven't gotten that far yet, but I know I know some lines. I want to get to the point where I can just know everything. Batman killed the first 25 J-Monies. He was definitely involved. Honestly, Alfred? Cooler than Batman. More interesting. The creation of the Batcave. More interesting than Batman. No, I, I get you, Loyal War. I just didn't... I don't really enjoy Outbreak that much. I feel like I would like it more if you could have, like, a six-person team, like, in this game. But I also feel like both games should be able to queue in with all six people. Not just, like, you queue in with three people and maybe you find others along the way that you can add to your group. If they already got the stuff to, you know, have six people on the same team, why can't we just queue in with all six? That's what will really make it fun. But an outbreak, like if contracts respawn, like the missions, kind of like how they do in this, I'd have more fun with it. Batman's the best DC superhero. Well, he doesn't really have that much competition. Him and Superman. Which, I mean, Superman, the OG superhero, whatever. You know, here, here's your flowers. Also lame. How you so OP, but weak to a rock. Super, or Superman also boring to me. Fuck him. No, I have not seen Cobra Kai. I don't really watch a whole lot of superhero stuff outside of, like... I... I fuck with Spider-Man. So I'll watch those movies. Especially, like, Spider-Verse. I think, like, Into the Spider-Verse and... Every, like, other Spider-Verse movie that comes out. Probably my favorite movies of all time. And I... I like Invincible. I can't wait for the... The rest of season two to come out, which is also stupid that they split it up into two seasons. I would have rather just waited for the whole thing, but it's whatever. And the boys. 
I fuck with the boys. Good ass show. And Gen V was good too. Aren't you dead? There you go. Epic Aether tool? Fuck it, dude. I'll take that. Shit. Yeah, I, I would assume it'd be like the last of the trilogy. I don't, I don't think they need to add more movies after that, but I just really love like the animation style, the story, the characters, like... Those movies are basically flawless. Homelander makes Superman his bitch. I don't know. I think Homelander's like weaker than we think. I think Superman could probably handle him. Like, Homeland are strong and all, but I feel like he's only strong in the universe of, like, the boys. In any other universe, he's probably getting wiped. Especially just because, like, I feel like any other superhero can just, like, get to him mentally. All they have to do is, like, go after his ego, and he'll either, like, get pissed off and, like, you know, rage out, make a mistake, and get taken out that way, or just, like, crumble. Have you seen the ones who live yet? No. Is that the Walking Dead thing? I have not seen it. Omni Man wipes home. Yeah. A Vultramite going against Homelander would destroy him. Band of Brothers of Pacific, Lost Utopia Heroes. I haven't seen... Lost, well, I've seen a bit of Lost. I never finished it, I don't think. Because when I was watching it with uh, my girlfriend, we we stopped watching it because we were about to go on a plane. And then we just never picked it back up. But it was good for what I watched. And Band of Brothers is also really good. I'll watch that like every other year. Really good series. I made it through like most of the Pacific, but I don't think I finished that either. It doesn't have like the same... I don't know, grip that Banner Brothers has, but it's still good. Oh, shit. Y'all forgot Superman has become a literal immortal god. He's gonna destroy entire galaxies with a punch. I didn't forget that. I didn't know. Dude was not interesting enough for me to know that. But also, that's too OP. You gotta, I mean, like, I, it, how do I put this? It's, I get why he has a kryptonite, you know? He has to have some sort of weakness, because if you're just OP and unstoppable, then there, there's no fun in it, because there's no challenge, you know? There's nothing that can take him out, but a rock? Eh, come on. you be better than that. I don't know what, but I ain't a writer. What a reward. I love doing these contracts just to get an uncommon Aether tool. How many thumb drives do I have? Oh shit, you're right. I should have probably been doing this. Eh, no, we can get it next game because all I'm doing is trying to stack my tombstone so I can just buy perks and stuff next game. Because we got, we have to go the whole, like, you know, the whole game time in our next game just to get the USBs. So I'm, I'm just getting this tombstone set up. Fuck it, dude. I'll take a turret circuit. Um, there's a cargo contract here. We can get to it before the people in tier 3 do. Why would DC even make pink crimson or anything? What is that? What is it just like a different color variant? Does it do anything different? I just, I just read you say JFK which season you on. And I was like, there's a JFK show? And then so I just saw someone in chat's JFK. Threw me for a loop. 
But speaking of uh, JFK show, there was a show that was like, it's called 112263. And it's about like some dude that goes back in time to try to stop like the JFK assassination. That's kind of cool. I fuck with it. I've seen that one a few times actually. I've never been up to tier three this way. I'm kind of scared. I don't know the area. I oh, know we're, we're here. We got it. We're chilling. Melania over Batman? True. And I haven't even fought Melania yet. Oh, this motherfucker just take the cargo contract? You couldn't have taken it earlier? Before I ran all the way here? Dick. No way I missed that throwing knife. Um, there's a bounty here. Well, I'm we'll just gonna do that. Oh, Paul with the the 699. Appreciate you, Paul. You need to fix the server. The servers ten times you crashed in three days. Never been so pissed off in my life. Every time you play with your your GF, the game crash. Hey, that's just how it goes, dude. I agree though. They do need to fix the crashes. It's so fucking annoying. It always happens at the the worst possible time. It can't just be like. When you don't have anything good on you. Or they can't just, you know, just make it so you don't crash at all. That would be pref preferable. But the server crashes are super fucking annoying. I'm with you, Paul. Sorry that happened, dude. And, and thank you again for the 699. Thoughts on the Lego Star Wars 25th anniversary sets? Some of them are pretty cool. Like, uh, I forget what it's called, but the, it's like the opening scene to episode four. Where it's like all the, the rebel troopers in the doorway. Or in the, the, what the fuck is it called? Hallway. With Vader coming in and it comes with, uh, was it Malak? Darth, Darth Malak or from, uh, what's the game? I don't know, but it comes with a really cool, like, minifig. I like some of the sets. I saw... I don't remember who was saying it last time, but they said they were pretty excited. Oh, it might have been Philly. Philly was saying that he's excited about the new R2, like, buildable. Like, the big model. I don't... I'm not too excited about that one. I don't think I'll get that. What I really want, though, is, like, uh, Obi-Wan, Qui-Gon versus Darth Maul uh, diorama. I think that would be cool, but I don't think it's happening. But according to some leaks, there should be... Uh, there's going to be like a Star Wars What If series coming out. And they're going to do like uh, an alternate like Millennium Falcon with like good Vader. Or like redeemed Vader or something like that. So that'd be cool. Oh, what the, where'd all my ammo go? I think there's an ammo thing right here. The tentative 5, 4. I, Roman numerals always fuck me up. I don't know... Which one goes first and what it means. Oh fuck. I activated it a second too late. Oh well. Um by turret circuit. I agree, Paul. If you crash, you should just be able to keep whatever's in your tombstone. You just should just keep whatever's, like, in your backpack regardless. There's been some times where I've crashed. Where I've kept what I went into the game with, but didn't keep anything I had in the game. Or other times where I, like... Say I, I set a tombstone this game and I crash the next game. I'll come back and my tombstone's been there sometimes. But the last two times, it has not. I feel that cooler. I, I got a few sets just sitting there because I have no room to put them anywhere. At least no room to put them anywhere where they're like safe from the cats, which is basically nowhere, but there's some spots that are safer than others. I have that, uh, the, like the Coruscant, uh, gunship with all like the red clones and, uh, 
Palpatine and Padme. And I haven't been able to build it yet. So there's just nowhere for me to put it. And I have like a, I, I made a whole like Tatooine mock before I moved. And I haven't been able to rebuild it because I don't have space for it. Don't fuck with the helmet printing on the fives when you think. I think it looks fine. Don't need monkey bombs. We gotta remember what perks we're, we don't need to bring in. And we got a cargo right here. We might as well do it. Unless there's a bounty that's close. I don't know if they're, I think it was like rumored that they're going to do that, Yash, where they're going to add like a, a banking mechanic or like a wallet to Modern Warfare Zombies, but at this point I would be, I wouldn't be surprised if they didn't. They're supposed to add like x streaks too, but I guess we'll see. Most of the MW2 weapons are still bugged in Zombies, really? I did a few not that long ago and I was still getting camo progress. Oh, is it still the bug where like you didn't have them leveled up beforehand? Like before the update that they don't work? Or is it something different? Your Millennium Falcon, X-Wing, the Ewok village? That's a nice set. I wish I had that one. Most Eisley man. Oh shit. Those are some good sets. I got a, like, one of those, uh, I can show you guys towards the end of the stream, but I got one of the, like, the really nice, like, replica lightsabers. I, I, I treated myself for my birthday. So if we end up beating this red worm or just towards the end of the stream, remind me, and I can show you guys. It's a, it's a Neopixel lightsaber. It's fucking cool as shit. I got Anakin's. It looks like the real, the real thing. Destroying what's happening. We're setting up a tombstone, so next game we can fight the red worm. And we're just talking about random shit while we do it. Um, I guess we can just do a, a weapon stash contract. Why not? Turn to a light, lightsaber from Disneyland. Great financial decision. I'm surprised it's that cheap there. But at least the, the, you had like the, did you just like get a lightsaber like off the shelf or did you do the whole thing where you build it? Cause like if, if you're getting the whole experience out of it, at least you got that, you know? You're a Lego guy, but not Lego Star Wars. The store like the ho Holy Grail. I think the Holy Grail for a lot of like Lego Star Wars heads is uh, the Cloud City set from, uh, what was it? Like 2000? Cause there's a, a Boba Fett in that set that has like, Exclusive printing. And that's like one of the most expensive minifigures out there. So I think that would probably be the Holy Grail. I don't think it'd be like the Millennium Falcon because there's been like a bunch of Millennium Falcon sets. Some of them are better than others. And like there's like huge sets that are like thousands and thousands of pieces. Like a huge display version of it. But I don't think that'd be like the Holy Grail. I think it'd either be the Cloud City set or I guess like the 2008 Death Star was pretty cool where it had like all the scenes on the Death Star from the movies and all those minifigs. I don't know. I don't know what else could be. Maybe like, uh, at least for me, I would love to have like Jango Fett's uh, ship, the, his slave one where it comes with uh, Jango and Boba. Like a young Boba. But that's like one of the more expensive sets. Second hand. It's not like crazy expensive, but... It's like $500 for it. And it's only like a, a few hundred pieces, if that. What's going on, Tito? Four zombies spawned at 80%. Yeah, gotta love it. 
weak contract. I tried the crossbow with explosive arrows. Um, I think I maybe tried it once or twice. I haven't used it in a long time though. Like not since like early season one, I don't think. I'm sure it's gas. We get that Breaking Bad Lego set. It was actually a Christmas gift. Uh, and it's like a, a bootleg, but it's a really nice bootleg. Like the pieces are basically identical to what Legos would be. I think it's uh it's called like 18k something is the brand. My parents got it for me and I don't I don't know where they got it from. I think they might have just like seen an ad for it or something. They know I like Legos and Breaking Bad. It was perfect. And then the the minifigs I have for it. I don't know if you can really see them there. But I got those like custom from uh one of those sites that makes them. Uh, we got 51k. I think that's fine. We're, anything else is probably going to be overkill. Let's uh, go take ourselves out and set our tombstone. Oh, the Imperial Star Destroyer set. Those ones are pretty cool, yeah. I don't know if it'd be like the Holy Grail, but it, it, it's like a really nice set. Brick Arms, the plug. Oh shit, this convoy is not fucking around. If season two reload is what you think he is, you're gonna have to waste a golden plate, dog bone, blade, pack three crystals, legendary tool. Oh yeah, I hope it's, it's a challenge, you know? I wanna be challenged in this game. I want to be fighting for my life, but I want it to be like a fun, rewarding challenge, you know? What should I drop here? I'm... F hmm. I feel like I'm not going to use the epic Aether tool because I'm going to spawn in with a legendary one. And I think I'm going to use the, the Ram 9 this time around. The Ram 9 and the VR 11. So I'll use the legendary Aether tool on that. As much as I want to keep the Epic Aether tool, I'm going to drop that because I want to have the self-revive in here. Are we good? Do we... We got 51,000 and we have Jug, PhD, Death Perception, Stamina Up, Quick Revive. So I should bring in anything besides those. So Jug, PhD, Death Perception, Stamina Up, Quick Revive. Jug, PhD, Death Perception, Stamina Up, Quick Revive. I'm going to forget those immediately, but... Um, anything else I should put in here? I think we're good. So I already have an operator that's got a tier 3 vest, a large backpack. I just need to buy a durable gas mask. Yeah, that warlord was way too easy. I agree, Paul. Oh yeah, Flash. I like it a lot too. It's very mobile and it's, uh... Pretty good gun. I like the Ram 9. Oh, Cheesy with the two. Thank you, Cheesy. Have a good night, man. Thank you for stopping by and thank you for being so generous today. I appreciate it, man. It means a lot. Jug, PhD, stamina, quick revive. Don't forget death perception. Because I will. Oh, and another five from Cheesy. Damn, Cheesy. Thank you, dude. Truly. Thank you, man. It means a lot. Very gracious. A lad and a scholar. Means a lot, dude. Appreciate you gifted another five. Okay, let's switch to which one? I'll go scorch. Go a little scorched earth. Let's grab. I'll change this out. Get our Ram Nine. I don't have a custom class for it. I'll just make one. Largest mag per use. We will throw on our hip fire laser. Uh, I don't think any of these barrels increase damage really. So I'm going to go with this comb that gives me more ammo. 
I'm gonna go with this. And where's a fast stock? Fast movement speed. Probably this one, right? Yep, this was our best bet. Do we even need a hand stop on this? Yeah, why not? Okay, dude. Also, this got beautiful camos. Gradient globs. One of my favorite camos. Yeah, I did get Nightbot in here. I, I made sure I checked before stream. Made sure he wasn't out wandering around again. I'll throw a throwing knife on here. So we got Jug, PhD, Death Perception, Stamina Up, Quick Revive. That's what we have in there. So we need Deadshot. We need Speed Cola. We don't really need to bring in Elemental Pop. We can always just buy that. I, I'm sure we can do that with any of these, but um, give me my armor plate. Give me my Aether Blade. You know, and give a dog a bone. Let's also grab... Oops, wrong one. Go over here. Do I bring in the Flawless Crystal? I'm going to need the VR11 for sure. Um... Do I bring in the Flawless Crystal? Or do I just use the money that I got? And save the Flawless in case we need to do it again. Yeah, fuck it. When I meet her in the middle and I grab a Refined. So I want to have a little bit of insurance in case this goes tits up. Should, do I bring in an Ammo Mod too? I think Napalm Burst is better, or Brain Rot? Napalm Burst is probably good against the Worm, right? Don't think I equipped the camo? No, I didn't. Because I'm just going to throw the Pack-a-Punch camo on it. But I was just showing it off. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Paul. The Pack 2, just in case. Should get that new Avengers Light Tower? Holy shit. Give me a second. Should you get the new Avengers Tower Lego set or the Star Destroyer? Um, I don't know. It's up to you, man. I, I don't really like a whole lot of like the MCU stuff like we were talking about earlier, but the Avengers Tower is pretty cool. A lot of cool minifigs in that. And it's a, a cool looking build, too. It's just huge. So you got to have a place to put it. Not going to do the stash glitch. I don't know how to new, do the new one. Shatter? Hmm. I don't know if I should bring in Shatter. Yeah, I'm gonna. Ha I'll have plenty of self revives. We're gonna have a lot of money, so I'm gonna. My whole inventory is gonna be self revives and USBs. I'm not grabbing another Sentry Gun. I don't care if it helps. I crashed basically the second I put one down last time. I don't. I don't. I don't give a fuck. I am not bringing one in. I'm bringing a Napalm Burst. That's what my gut's telling me to do. Thoughts on Gobblegums possibly returning? That'd be cool. I don't mind them too much. Like, you can always... Like, if you think they're, like, too OP or whatever, you can always just not use them or use the default ones. That really bothered me. The only thing where it, it bothered me <laughs> was, like, playing with Silky, and he had, like, his account glitched or whatever, where he just had, like, every Gobblegum, like, infinite amount of them. And he would just do like, you know, perkaholic, you know, uh, buying free or whatever, shopping free, whatever it's called, and just do everything. And I'm I'm over there like scrounging for points. Don't forget about my scorcher. I'm not bringing in a scorcher. I'm gonna have the VR11. Am I missing anything else? I ain't singing you a lullaby. Tried with five people and got wrecked. Damn. Brain rot for red worm? Fine. I'll bring in brain rot.
Am I missing anything else? I always feel like I'm going to forget something, but I think this is fine. This is good. We'll be alright. Swapping your items with the reward. Oh, that's what, like, that used to be the glitch, but now, like, uh, if I go to swap this, I guess, I since I don't have my thing full, it will go in here, but if I win a swap, it'll just tell me to, like, destroy it. I don't think that works anymore. Yeah, I know it helps get around the map faster, but we'll be all right. Now let's do this. This is all good. Let's go in. Let's try to not switch out our Aether Blade this time. I, I never got my brain with me. Yeah, I'm going to buy the durable. Oh yeah, thank you, DJ. It's been a while since I fought the worm. I forgot about that strat of uh, throwing nades at the ground when he goes under. Because that's what I did a lot in uh, the Act 4 mission. That helped a lot. They better nerf the cooldowns. I don't think that's going to happen. It'd be nice, though. Or if, at least they add some way to, you know, minimize them. They must have patched it, but duped items don't count as real items. Oh. Yeah, I haven't been able to do it since the update. What clan go crazy? It does. Looking for two more players? You better get your ass in here. Let's hope our tombstone's there. There's no reason why it should be gone, but... Yeah, with my luck. Hey, I appreciate it, Kaysen. Are there schematics should they drop for content? I don't know. Just about anything in the game, they should make a schematic. Like a tier, like a a, a large backpack or a, a three plate vest would be nice. Our tombstone is there. No, I'm not gonna send a red worm message. I don't want anybody else to do it with me. I want to do it on my own. So let's activate this, activate this, throw that on, throw this on, throw this on, use this, use this. I will use the VR11 in a second. Let's go get to our tombstone. But operator, I have uh, Scorch is the name of the operator. I don't remember what it's, the actual bundle is called, but it's like the, it's got a bunch of like Ethereum crystals on it. Appreciate it, Hayden. Nice flash. I think it's pretty nice. I don't really need too much, like, extra damage to it. Like, there, there's not really a whole lot that adds damage to it. It's just good on its own. True, true nose here. I was thinking about that the other day. I was like, damn. They really took out that whole Rabinov bundle. If you died in the Aether, does the Tombstone stay there or go on the regular map? I think it spawns at, um... It'll spawn in the graveyard by the church. Like, it'll go... Over to this area here. It'll be, like, right here. Over an I-3. A chain money operator? That'd be crazy. Honestly, I wouldn't even really want an operator. Well, operator would definitely be cool. Don't get me wrong. I'd rather have like a, a weapon 
like a blueprint or like a, a camo or something with like my colors on it. We got something pretty similar to it last year. There was a uh, an MP7 blueprint that bit was basically like my channel colors and almost the logo, which is cool. Doctor Pack bundle. Welcome. Need a fucking haircut. I think I'm gonna get one tomorrow. My hair is too damn long. You can't really tell that much, like on here, like on the the face cam. My hair is long as shit. I have not gotten it cut since before the game came out. I've been locked in. Okay, let's use that. Use that. Use that. Use that. Use that. Stow that. Stow that. Stow that. Stow that. And now we can grab our VR11. I will pack a punch it once. And now let's go grab pack three on both of these. Buy a durable gas mask. And then go get our USBs. The shame money hand grenade. I would want a throwing knife skin, actually. That would be sweet. Or if uh, I get it during like a Black Ops game in this hypothetical world, a Tomahawk skin would be awesome. Where the the Tomahawk is like my, the triangle in my logo. That'd be hard. No, I don't think I'm going to go for Borealis again. I don't want to keep uh, doing the thing where I just gr grind the camos on like new accounts again. I think I'm going to be one and done for this game. Reverse Mohawk? Hell no. You guys have seen that, like, dog? That's That's got, like, the, the buttons for speech. He's like, did you eat a treat? They're saying you ate a treat. And he goes, H hell no. Silky got that on his soundboard, and he just plays it all the time. It is embedded into my brain. Where's pack a punch at? Over here. Yeah, there was a throwing knife skin. They have done it before. It's going good, Nitro. Thanks for asking, bro. H hell no. And then there's the other one where it's like it, the dog's got like a, a angel halo or an angel halo over his head, and it's like heck yes. Heck yes. Hey, if you're the, the same lobby of apocalypse, you can come like do stuff with me like before the worm fight, but I'm going to ask you to leave when the worm fight starts. I really want to do it solo. So if uh, you could please respect that, I would be grateful. A Breaking Bad bundled the model for zombies, bro. I would buy a Breaking Bad bundle so fast. Yeah, let's work towards our USBs. Let's see if we can just find the one in tier 3 real quick. Wouldn't it be too hard? Oh yeah, it's right here. Look at me go. Mangler, stop. Bad. Give me that. Halsey for 33 months. Appreciate you, dude. That's a long fucking time. How many? That's three years? Over three years? Slightly under, maybe? Math is not my strong suit, but I appreciate you, dude. I think that might be one of the longest, if not the longest, membership on this channel. Thank you for sticking around for so long. and It means the most. What a fucking legend. We get some hearts in chat for that one. Good luck. Hope it's better than the last time. Thank you. Me, me too. I'm right there with you. Oh, 
appreciate you. Walter. Put your dick away, Walter. I'm not having sex with you right now, Walter. One of my friends showed that to his dad. And he's like, Mike wouldn't say that. <laughs> it's fucking funny. Obviously, Mike wouldn't say that. Bro didn't understand the joke. Is this shit in the storm? No, it's not. Is this you already waiting over here by the, the pictures apocalypse? What's up, dude? So this is near the PhD, the free PhD. And this is here at the military base. That's the broken building and we already got down. Look, look how fast I, I got these down. You can tell how many times I've done this red worm and crashed. Son and I, I slap the red worm. Let's fucking go, dude. I'm hoping I can, I can take that, take your, your energy from that and move it on to this game. I will beat this motherfucker with my own two hands if I have to. Jeez, the storm really threw me off. I don't know where I was at. I couldn't see the, the landmark over there. Give me that. Appreciate your cheese. Got the power of God and anime on my side. So we got military, we got tier three. Um, we need broken building and PhD. Bars, dude. Somebody stop me. It's my favorite video I've ever made. Uh, I don't know. It's tough. I really like those Smash Bro montages that I've made. Those were a lot of fun. Um, my guides, I like those a lot. I was pretty proud of those. I wish I, I could go back and like remaster them and just have better like, I don't know, voiceover for myself. Cause I was like recording them in the middle of the night and it sounded like I was whispering and I wasn't like the most comfortable on the mic yet. So I'd redo that. Um, I really like my Dark Aether video, like the first time I unlocked it. That one was fun. And the April Fool's video from a few years ago. Where I, I was like, Zombies Chronicles 2? Oh, fuck. Stupid ass mercs, dude. South Park custom zombies game. There's probably co like custom zombies maps for South Park. They gotta be out there. My opinion on the reloaded update. I'm glad we're finally gonna be getting some zombies content if that's when it's releasing. Watch it still not release that reloaded. I shouldn't put that out there. Then it's gonna happen. I'm glad we're finally gonna get some stuff for it. Damn, open the whole door. There it is. That's what we're looking for. I should probably go buy the rest of my perks too. I should have done that when we're in tier three. Oh yeah, trick shotting the, the DMR for Dark Matter. That was fun. I was stressing, dude. It took me so many games trying to actually just hit the shot. It took forever. And I was so scared I was gonna accidentally just get a really lame kill and that be like what we what we got Dark Matter for. It was still kind of a weak trick shot, but at that point it was like, I've been doing this for like three hours trying to get this one shot. Let me just get this camo. Repair the vehicle with your VR. You are so smart, dude. 
I forget you can do that. I was just think the only time I've ever done it is escort vehicles. So I didn't even think about using it on any other vehicle. Over silky in a spelling bee. The world would collapse. That stupid lucky apocalypse. A two day cooldown really sucks. I hate it. Or the 72 hour cooldown. It don't need to be that long. How long will the, the VR11 cooldown be? I think it's 48 hours. Crazy. What's the release date for the Reloaded update? Uh, Wednesday. Wednesday at like... Noon? Some stuff will drop at like 11. Some stuff will, will drop at noon. And then like whatever event's going on then will probably drop at 1. All in uh, Eastern time. As you can buy a pack crystal one, two, or three. I mean, you don't really need to buy a pack crystal if you can just buy pa like pack a punch. Probably like the same price, but you're talking about just like leaving with the crystal. I guess that's that'd be cool. I'd rather be able to buy like aether tools. You like disabled people? What the fuck is that nitro? You're still just people, bro. What question is that? Alright, we got all of our USBs. Let's go back to tier 3, get our gas mask. Get all of our perks. And then, uh, I don't know, we can just do some bounties. Stick around for a bit. Mega bomb skin. I can see them doing that. I mean, we've already gotten like a an aether worm skin. I wouldn't be surprised. You ever think they they do a Black Ops one or two remaster? Isn't it like a rumor that the game in between or the game after? The Black Ops game this year is going to be like some sort of other Black Ops remaster. I don't know if they'd ever do it, but it's always like a rumor every year. That's something like that's going to happen. Be cool. You have to mark a part scope. Looks like a scope from COD Advanced Warfare. I think it is. It's pretty cool. I like it. It's nothing like crazy. It's not going to like change anything, but it's a clean sight. I can appreciate a clean sight. We got the shop right over here. We can hit up the Wonder Fist first. I got time for you, Mega Bomb. Actually, I'll have time for you later. Let me get my my whatever in order. I couldn't think of the other word. Affairs in order. There it is. Jesus Christ, jeez. Don't be saying that kind of shit. Give me that and that. We'll get on perks. Drop two nukes in a game with the aftermarket part with the haymaker? That's fucking wild. I used the haymaker aftermarket part a little bit uh, when I was grinding for the Walking Dead camo. Herbal gas mask. Wait, how am I already broke? Damn, you can spend 51k in this game fast. We gotta make some money. So I got another spot for a self revive. Oh, a legendary Aether tool on here. Okay. I'll keep that with me. That'll be my reward when we make it out of here. And hopefully, we get the schematic for legendary Aether tool too. 
That's the one schematic I'm missing. Was there a Doom Operator, though, or was it just the weapons? I don't think we got an Operator for it, did we? I, th I have that bundle, too, and I don't even know. Grab a sentry. I would. But every time I crashed the last time is when I used the kill streak. When I used like the jug, I crashed. And when I put down a sentry gun, I crashed. So I'm just going to assume that's the reason why I'm crashing. Somehow. And I'm going to avoid it. I'm going to get it done just with the VR 11. We'll see what happens. And there's a good chest on this building. And honestly, whenever I try to like solo the Red Worm or whenever I've tried to, you can't even really carry that many sentry guns. Like, four spots are taken up by the bones. Right? Or, or the bones, the USBs. And then the, the rest is going to be like self-revives. I know people have said just like put the USBs on top of a car and drive it to a shop. They won't despawn for a bit, but I don't want to risk that. I feel like I'll fuck that up or the car will blow up or I don't know. Something will happen. I'll lose the USBs. Try to get the Warzone nuke challenge done. It'll be fun, but I, I don't really know anybody that plays Warzone like that to help carry me to it. Because I don't know if I'd be able to solo it. I definitely wouldn't be able to. Mimic, what the fuck is your problem, dude? I barely got that delivered. Jeez, it's like run into a brick wall. I'm just gonna... I know you guys are gonna be mad at me for this. Actually, you no, know, whatever. A uh, pack a punch two crystal ain't that important. The cashmere's will definitely help. I just gotta make sure that I... Stow my, uh... Decoys for it. When I use it. Oh, come on. That's stuck on a fucking rock. Ugh, I, I just want to use the Hellhound now. Because I, I, I said this a lot last stream, but every time I use the Hellhound for the Red Worm fight, it just dies immediately. And it's like useless. I just brought it in for fun. But you can't beat my worm. Yeah, you're right. I cannot. Guess we'll just go uh, looting here in tier 3. Let's see if we can find any good items. See if we can find another legendary aether tool. We ain't got shit else to do. I don't know even why I looked in that. There's never going to be anything in these bags. Let's do a bounty. Fuck it. Let's see if we can't get another, like, one of those crazy bounties or rewards like last time. We got, like, five items. You fuck with WWE? Not really. I mean, like, I don't really watch it a whole lot. I don't mind it. I don't really care to, like, follow it. But it's all right. Like, I, I played the games a bit. But I'm not, like, a huge fan of it. I got a few friends that are, though. So, like, whenever they're watching it, I'll, I'll peep. I don't really follow it too heavily. How's the bioluminescent grind going? Finish your 51 weapons now? I'm at, like... Oh, first of all, congrats on getting that done. But I think I'm at, like, 16 weapons out of the 51 I need. So I'm not close at all. But we're having fun with it. I'm taking my time with it. You see how fast we took out two of his heads, though? I just need that, that mouth to glow, pal. What does that mouth do? Open up. There you go.
Go to the fucking decoy. Damn. Why do decoys take so long to go off? It's ridiculous. I f keep forgetting I have the Aether Blade. It's, yeah. Right, right as you say it, Adam, is when I remember. I was like, oh shit. I forgot I have this. I never really use it. The only time I use it is when I try to fight the Red Worm. They nerfed the tier 3 bounty rewards? I think they actually got buff. We might have just got unlucky on that one. Alright, now I got time for you, buddy. Yeah, there you go. Hey, I will forget to use the Aether Blade again, so don't you worry. There's plenty more opportunities for me to be dumb. Beat Drake Snake? That's gonna be the, the Season 2 Reloaded boss. Use the bone. No, I'm gonna save it. I'll just save it. Ray, whoa, 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 who do you think you are coming in here trying to steal my abomination kill? Oh, another legendary Aether tool. Um, shit. You know what? Fuck it. You can have that. I'm going to be using the rest of these. You know what? Actually, fuck a cashmere. Give me that. We're getting out of here with some goods. If we can kill this thing. Don't drop it again. I'll try not to. You got... I need somebody to pay attention to it. I need somebody to babysit me on that. Because the second you see it out of my inventory, I need I need you to yell at me and tell me to go get it. You can shoot the floor with that? It's better for zombie control? Oh, I didn't know it did splash damage. I appreciate that flash. Thank you, dude. Killed 10 disciples in one game is kind of crazy. Uh, not really. It ain't that bad if you do like a tier 2 outlast. You can make them spawn basically like infinitely. Where's the fight even gonna be at? I didn't even look. Storm's there, so fight's here. Okay. Shoot a laser, dickhead. What? He just ate the laser. Like, actually. He chewed on it. Why did that not blow his head up? That'd be sweet if the VR-11, like, brain-rotted the Mega Bomb. That'd be so fun. Just have a, a pet Mega Abomination. Why did it break the Elite? Like, the HVT Mega Bomb's faces immediately, but this one is just tanky. Am I, like, missing? There we go.
Uh, let's go do another bounty. I'm just gonna die. Use it now for the bone. I could. I don't wanna. Get on the decoy, get on the decoy, get on the decoy, get on the decoy. Thank you. We're stream couponing this game. No, that, that bounty mega went down easier is what I was saying. It was like the, the default one was just eating the shots. I always go all the way around the building before I realize the staircase is right here. Every time. This one's only a mangler. Use the bone. What headset do I have? It's the Arctis Nova Pro Wireless. It's a really good headset, but the ear cups are like kind of uncomfortable. They're a bit small. For my old Arctis, I got like replacement like ear pads like these. And it was really comfortable on there. These ones, like I've gotten used to them now, so it's not as bad, but they can like hurt after a while. But otherwise, it's a great headset. It's got a good mic on it if you need to use the mic for it. Um, it sounds great. You can have, on top of it being wireless, like I can have it connected to my computer and hear everything on my computer, but I can also put it on Bluetooth and hear everything on my phone. But it is not the comfiest. But I got it like around the time like it first came out. So maybe there's like a newer version that's more comfortable or now they have like replacement ear pads. But if you're going to be like playing games for a long time with it on, it's probably going to hurt. Why do bounties just blow up sometimes? Are they scared to fight us? That's what I always say. They're cowardly. Does it do anything when I shoot the ground? I don't think anything happened. I think I just threaded the needle between all those zombies and didn't hit anything. Can I get my reward, please, zombies? You guys are kind of being dicks. Don't get crazy. How you doing, dude? The headset dent. I don't think I got one, but I would not be surprised if I did. I wear a headset for fucking at least 10 hours a day every day, so I would not be surprised if I had one. But if I'm walking around looking like Tyler 1 with that dent, I'm gonna kind of be upset about it. You ever play Dying Light 2? No, but I watched my friend play it a bit and it looks fun. I don't know if I'd really get into it though. Use the bone. <laughs> he won't die. He's gonna live a long life in a farm upstate. That's exactly what's gonna happen to our, our dog, our hellhound. What's up, Hells? How's it going, dude? Shaves his head, he's gonna look like a bean. That'd be so sad. What do we do for the next 13 minutes? Already done like 80 bounties in tier 3. I want to stay in this area near where the fight's going to happen. Eh, let's go uh, fight the Stormcaller. Why not? No, I don't watch One Punch Man. I don't really watch like any anime. The only thing I, I'll watch is like Pokemon and then like Invincible. If 
I don't really think Invincible counts as an anime. I need to see the headset then. If I ever find out I have one, you guys will never know. I will get like, uh, like a silicone replacement for that part of my head. I, I'll just have it like resting on top there. It'll kind of be like a toupee. Think you'll ever bring back Garfield? I hope not. That shit was so stupid. That was kind of fun though. I had fun doing that. Doing those like stupid ass challenges for Cold War. They really made no sense and they were like so niche. Like I can't imagine like somebody from like outside of like, you know, my normal viewers seeing that video and being like, what the fuck is going on? Like, how do you even explain that? Where are the feet picks? Behind a $8,000 paywall. Invincible is really good. Let's go give that Stormcaller a piece of my mind. Gotta make sure that we don't uh, break our gas mask though, going to fight him. I know it's gonna die, Quincy, but you know, maybe it'll be different this time. Maybe it'll live. We never know. Thank you, Nose Hair. It was fun to make. That's our problem with the servers. Last time we did this, we crashed before fighting the worm boss twice in a row after playing a whole game to set up our tombstone before each game. The, the last time he crashed was literally one frame before the worm spawned in, which was terrible. Like, I don't even know how that happens. It was, it had to be like made up the way it happened. Where you at, Stormcaller? There we go. Broke his shit, broke his posture. Come here. What's this doing against you? Not really stopping you from healing. So that's not good. Switch weapons, please. I don't know what it is with the VR-11, but I feel like I can never switch weapons with it. Like, it's always slow. There's like such a long cooldown after the shot that you can't even like alternate what weapon you're using. There we go. All gone. Let's repair this shit. Say everything that comes to your head for the next three seconds. Cock, balls, dick, penis. That's all you get. I know that was that was terrible i can't believe how close we were to just getting into the fight for it to crash like that was it looks scripted somebody at activision was just like crying laughing when they they hit the crash my game button 
my thoughts on K-pop. I don't, I haven't really listened to it, like, ever. But I don't really, I don't know, I don't really have an opinion on it. It's cool, I guess. So since the dog literally is going to die within like a few seconds, at least it'll like distract the zombies long enough for me to get like a few good shots in without them hounding me. I wish there was a shop a little closer by though, so I could just go and grab like some uh, self revives or something. What will I do if somebody donates 420.69? I will say thank you very much. Um, I don't know. I'd probably get a boner, but I can't show that on a stream. It'll just be there under the table. Will I be live again? I don't even know, bro. It's random. I do want to stream more. I am prioritizing like doing videos and stuff over that. So we'll see. I'm at least going to do it like one stream a week, but it's going to be on like whatever day is like the easiest for me. There is a shop close to me? Where? Am I stupid? Oh, this shop? But that doesn't sell self revives. You can't get those at tier ones, can you? You're so calm saying that. I say everything with the, the same inflection for the most part. But this, if we end up actually taking this worm down and it doesn't give me the legendary Aether tool schematic, I might have a problem. If that happens, then we'll just do another game. Wait, I'll uh, open it up to viewers. Yeah, tier 2 is for self-revives. I don't see a tier 2 shop near here, though. All the way over here is the closest one. Flick these. Come on, bro. Do I ever laugh? I don't think I've ever laughed in my life. Nothing's ever been funny. I wish you didn't have to wait till like the end of the game to fight the worm. Why not they they just spawn it there? Like kill the storm caller to start the fight. And then it spawns the the USBs. That would be sweet. Oh, fuck it, let's do an escort contract while we're waiting. Be something to do. So I don't want to go too far away and then like have a less than optimal amount of time to fight it. Called dibs on viewer game. It's gonna be first come first serve. Who's shooting at me? You turn into a merc and you shoot back. I don't want to watch this war. You gotta fight him? Shoot that guy. Shoot him. Whatever, dude. I think I know what glitch you're talking about, Ethan. People were trying to get me to do that last time, where you can put a, like, a legendary Aether tool on the Wonder Weapon by, like, using the Jug Suit or something. Or, like, that was patched, or... There's a different one where you have to, like, fully die, or... I, I, I don't know exactly how it works, but people were trying to tell me about it last time.
Our lone way game is shipment. The whole other team's rocking dragon breath shoddies. Probably just leave the game. Or adapt. I pull out my, my RGL. Would simply drop a nuke on him. Disciple, slow your roll there, bucko. I've been really trying not to think about crashing. So I feel like I'm gonna speak it into existence, but it's too late now. for Warzone Mobile. It looks pretty good, especially since you can, like, progress your MW3 weapons and stuff in it. I'll probably play it a little bit. We'll see what's going on. I hope they put it on, uh, Blue Stacks or, uh, I don't remember what the name of that, like, mobile emulator is. So I don't know how I'm just gonna record it on my phone. Storm's moving. By the time this contract's over, we should be good to start the fight. Or at least, like, be close to it. I feel about only getting one quest of the mid-season update. Not surprised. But I hope it's not the last of the stuff that we get for the mode. Because that would suck if, uh, for the rest of this game's life cycle, that's it. You know? Oh, there's a convoy here? Well, I'm gonna turn one of your friends into a zombie and I'm leaving. What the thing? Alright, fuck y'all, y'all. I'm out of here. I don't got time for this. Cats or dogs? I like them both. I currently have two cats, but I want to get a dog. Did you get a pet pig? No. They're cute and all. I don't want no pig. All right, game, don't fuck me over, please. Or 
first time chatter, lifetime fan. Appreciate you, dude. I need to have like a sound bite for that. Like all the like radio shows have. First time, long time. Boy, if you don't get the fuck on out of here, skedaddle. My worm. Mine. Who up playing with they worm? Alright. Throw on the gas mask. I don't have to wait for the animation once it hits this. There we go. That's one. That's two of them. That's three. One more. And that is four. Bring on the worm. These are only tier two zombies. I'm gonna deal with no tier threes. So we just gotta get close to them and use this. And then, oh, I don't have any nades to throw at the ground. I guess I can. I might be able to just shoot at the ground with the VR11. That might bring him out of hiding if he goes under. I gotta remember to spam my parachute if he. Goes to spit me out. And we we should be all good. Thank you, Hells. I had a lot of fun putting that together. There it is. What's up, bitch? Oh, wait, let's call on our dog. Arf. You get right up close to him. Let's just Aether Shroud for fun. The R11 looks sick with Aether Shroud. At least we get to fight him this time. No crashing. Spamming the parachute. There we go. Got me sitting sideways. Got me leaning. We're doing good damage to him though. That's not bad for the fight like just starting. Right up on his shit. Already got him to half health. That's what we like to see. Fuck his orbs. Switch weapons, please, so I can shoot him. There we go. I wish this shot just a little bit faster. Well, that's not bad damage. He's already almost dead. We're getting there. Less than half. There we go. That's what I thought, little bitch. Can't eat me. Can I not parachute? Oh my god, I was about to lose my mind. There was no indication that I could parachute there. I would have been so pissed. We gotta repair this shit now. Cocksucker. Come on. Yeah, I knew you were a spitter. 
That's gonna be a down, I think. Whoa, 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 what do you think you're doing? That's my worm. Please, bro. Fuck off. I don't need no help. And you ain't taking my fucking blueprint either. I'll tell you that for free. Oh, two people showing up right at the end just to take the goodies, huh? We fucking got it, though. Oh, self-revive now. I do not need them taking my shit. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? No, we didn't get the schematic for it. Damn. All right, well, we're going to have to do another game. Damn, dude. That's so lame. I just want the legendary Aether Tool schematic. We finally beat it on our own. But we didn't get what we're looking for. Still with six minutes to spare, too. The VR11 is crazy. Alright, well. Guess we got Axfil. Oh, those guys are dicks. They showed up at the last second just to get the rewards. Did all that work. All right, well, I'm going to throw the group ID up and I'm going to go take a pee. Feel free to join the group and the first come first serve to who gets in the party is uh, who we're going to be attempting the worm with next game. So I want to see if I can still get that legendary Aether tool. That schematic for it. That'd be so nice. Goddamn vultures. I know, right? That's like people that go into your, uh, like, stronghold after you clear it out. Or, like, they shoot the last spore. Good night, Nitro. Those guys definitely remind the teacher of homework. True. Okay. Um, first, let me set the... Party settings. Max party size to three. Because otherwise I'll have to kick people and I don't want to play like favorites or anything. It'll be on invite only for now. When I come back, I will set it to open. How do I... I always forget how to navigate these menus. Um... No. How do I show my group? Not there. Also, let me go ahead and turn off voice chat so y'all aren't saying anything crazy on stream. Hmm. Social? Groups. The J Buddies, right there. J Buddies 2975475. So go ahead and join that. Then I'm gonna open it up to people in the group and the first two people to join in we'll play with and try to beat the worm. So bring uh, your good shit. Cause I don't, I don't really have anything to hand out. I'm gonna be selfish. I'm keeping my shit. Oh, I immediately closed it out. Sorry. I was, I, that's how quick my, my train of thought leaves. But here's the group. Go ahead and join it. I'm gonna go pee real quick. And then we're gonna come back and uh, try to beat the worm. Or mission to stream snipe. I, if you're gonna help us fight the worm, sure. Go ahead. But I will be back in like 49 seconds starting now.
We back. All right, so hopefully you guys joined. If you wanted to come and play, you can join the group. I'm about to open this shit up. Party settings. Set it to friends and channels. No, wait. Open is what I need to set it to. Open, there you go. Now let's set up our class for this next fight. I'm probably going to bring the VR-11 in again. Uh, I guess if we have a group, we don't really need the VR-11. I can save that for, like, doing anything else. How many VR-11s do I have? Oh, I got another one in here. I got one, two... Two of them. Hmm, might as well bring it. Why not? We'll have some fun. Let's put the epic Aether Tool away. We'll bring in another legendary Aether Tool. Um, might as well bring in the flawless crystal so we can work towards getting, uh, whatever other weapons done or packed. Give me these. Those 50 seconds prepare to be crucified. Hey, it happens, bro. I thought I just... Oh, I did. For a second, I thought I didn't have a cooldown on stamina up after using it. I'm not going to have my golden armor plates, which sucks, but... We'll be alright. I just have to remember to actually uh, armor up. Also, if you guys invite me to a party, I'm not going to be joining. It's first come, first serve. So maybe next time. What else do I need to bring in here? I guess I'll bring an elemental. That'll be fine. This is decent. Who we got here? Who's in here? Apocalypse and Panda? Alright, boys. It's time to roll out. Am I gonna release more merch? Eventually, yeah. I wanna get, like, some good designs done and figure out how to get them with uh, my current, um, like, merch group I'm working with. Like my operator, I'll carry you. Oh, that's the nuke one, right? That's sick. Go ahead and ready up, Panda. I don't want to start it up if you're still, like, grabbing stuff out of your stash. There we go. Let's get it. Remind me at the end of this game, by the way, to show you guys the lightsaber. I saw it again. Once I, I walked back in the room. I want to forget. Oh, that's... You're paying to Legendary? Let's go. What's up, Josh? Uh, I don't know if I'm going to do another game after this, Lopez. But we, we can do some more, like, games throughout, like, the, the weeks. You know, this won't be the only other time that we do it. Drake's lightsaber? Man, Drake's meat today. Which lightsaber? Hold on. I can show you a little bit of it, but I'm not going to turn it on right now. I'm screwing the two pieces together. I got this bad boy. I don't have the blade in it right now because it's like a actually like long thing of like light like it's a basically a big i don't know like fluorescent bulb but it looks like the real thing i don't know how well it's going to show up on the camera because i've tried to like take videos of it on my phone this camera is better than my phone camera but just the the hilt is like pretty well detailed like it looks like the real thing kind of sick no i did not crash again trying to solo it surprisingly we actually did it
No, I don't think anyone ever did find out why the painting bubbles on uh, on Maurer. I still want to know. It is Anakin's. Because for Halloween this year, I'm going to be Anakin. I'm going to get like the whole... I already found like a good costume for it. that I'm just waiting to buy. It's got like the the prosthetic hand and everything. It's sweet. You got a permit for that, buddy? Why don't you come and take it? How'd you get that operator? I thought it was not purchasable. It was in my store and I just picked it up. It was in the store for a while. Like it came out early. Like one day I was just on and I opened the shop and it was in there like before I was supposed to be there. But then they just re-released it later on. Yeah, Legendary Aether Tool is the only schematic I need. That's the last one. They were NBA team. I don't really watch basketball, but I'd have to go with the Pistons since that's the hometown team, even though they've been kind of asked this year. Why is this not starting? It just says connecting. Should we cancel and restart? Or is this like a ping thing? Are we all too far away from each other? I'm gonna cancel it. I'll try again. Yeah, I am a Lions fan. Born and raised. We're all basically the same level too. You guys are ahead of me. We're all within the same range. Oh yeah, now it says loading level. No crashes today so far. Uh, knock on wood. Oh yeah, the, the free wing stop. It was like, it was like wing stop scamming y'all. Nobody's getting it. Just need the epic Aether Tool plans. That one was evading me for so long. We're on a raider all day. Let's go, dude. Okay, so I'm going to start with pack three, but I'm still going to need enough money to get my other weapon to pack three to my VR-11. So we got to run some contracts. Thanks, Lynn. What made you stream on YouTube instead of Twitch or Kick? All, all my audience is on YouTube. I did stream on Twitch for a while, but the YouTube streams always did like better. Bro, bro, I, I don't. Fine. I'll use yours. We'll try it out. Oh, that's a sweet skin on it. Go take my gun. Go for that. What, you, you want me to take this pack, Crystal? Are you sure, bro? You got the, you got the, oh, you brought in armor plates? What a doll. Thank you, dude. Are you sure? Because we can do contracts and I can get my, my shit right. Shit. Appreciate ya. Alright, well, well. Let's go get some money so we can buy some extra self revives and stuff. Probably won't need a pack 3 since you got a squad. True, but I want the overkill. This worm needs to go down. Let's uh, let's just go right for. Oh, I keep having the, the VR11 sound effect going constantly. Why is that happening? Lame. I don't even remember what I was saying because the sound effect threw me off. Oh yeah, I did see that, Devin. Because there's a thing where like you could just drop whatever weapon you had like an underbarrel attachment on and pick it back up, and you'd have all the ammo for it. Oh yeah, we're, we're gonna go do the, the USBs. So let's... Oh, it's a Merc camp. We're gonna have to clear them out. Reloading. 
What's up, predictions? Yeah, people are like super friendly in Modern Warfare Zombies. I ran into a lot of people that are just dropping stuff. The R11 is kind of a silly looking wonder weapon. It looked like a bug. Oh shit. Cleared it. Cleaned it. This mark camp's about to not know what hit it. Nobody is surviving in here. Or out here. These guys are gonna come down. There we go. Okay, so I know where that is. That's right over here. That is these apartments down here. We got oh, this is at the this is right here where we're at, the military base, and then that's tier three by where the pack of punch and wonder fizz is. Okay. We got this. What did you ping? Oh, is it? Oh, it's the worm logo. Hop in, gamers. So we gotta go here, 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 and the military base. Is a beetle gun. A month and 20 days until 420. Yeah, we're going to do our, our annual... Uh, how high of a round can we get? Wait, what? Apocalypse timed out? No! We're a man down. Just crashed? I'm sorry, dude. That fucking sucks. So annoying it happens in this game. So often. I'm sorry, man. I wish there's a way to rejoin. Alright, Hero, you can carry two and I'll carry two. So we both have, like, the same amount of inventory space. So I'll get the next one. All right, let's uh, go to tier three and grab that one. That's really fucking frustrating. Apocalypse, I'm sorry, dude. Especially after loading in with stuff to fight the worm with. Did it for wars, I don't know what they wouldn't do for zombies. Yeah, exactly. I don't fucking get it either. Same with, like, ranked. I switched... Earlier, I was playing a bit of ranked, and I switched my game from, like, windowed borderless to full screen, and my game crashed, and I just lost SR. Just suspension, lose SR, you're done. That's just how it went. All because the game couldn't handle switching windowed mode. Oh, you kept all your stuff? Oh, at least that's good. Want to stay with your EP? Hey, I get it. People be getting EP, man. Shit happens. Yeah, I'm gonna go over to this uh, Aether Rift. Because we don't have any gas in this. And I'm heading right towards these. And then once we get all of our USBs, we can just do uh, some contracts. 
Crash is coming for you next. Don't say that. Don't say that. Don't you put that evil on me. Okay, your gun's going cool down as well. Yeah, that's that's fucking the worst part. Oh, wait, we, you're going to go. I got gotcha. you. Divide and conquer. Smart. But it is, that is like the worst part about crashing is like you get punished for it. Like you just went and died. Like it, it, there is completely out of your control. Lose everything and get your weapons on cooldown. It's like the most insulting when you bring in something that has like the 72 or 48 hour cooldown. <sighs> you saying EP made me EP. It's such a funny term. My friend Siggy started saying that. And then all my other friends in Discord are like, you don't don't fucking say that. Knock that off. How many fucking zombies are right here? Jeez, it's like I started an Outlast contract. Get ray gun. No. Give me that. All right. Once you grab yours, there should be all of them. And then we can just make our way to tier three. I'll I'll get jump started on a a tier three bounty so we can start getting some money. What's up, chunky? Only game I know where you can get punished for playing it. I mean, there's Dark Souls. But that's the punishing you you look like you, you know is going to happen going into it. Got timed out for two hours and ranked for leaving. Yeah, that's the worst shit. Oh, thank you, Cake. Thank you, Chunky, chunky Jaffa Cake. I don't know why I always just pick one part of somebody's name to say because it's it's a mixed bag whether or not I'm gonna pronounce the the entire thing. But appreciate you, dude. Thank you for being a member for three months. That's a lot. Where is a bounty? There it is. I got one self revive, so we gotta we gotta clean this. I don't see how we couldn't clean it though with how stacked we are weapon wise. Let me not get too ahead of myself. Can't use your guns, you don't play. You can go to MP. That's just how you how you gotta do it. it. It sucks that it even happens in the first place. It's so stupid. Worst part about this game. Uh oh. A cascade of yawns is starting. It's like one time a few streams ago where I started yawning and I could not stop. I don't know what happened. It was like my, my brain lacked oxygen. This is such a roundabout way. I could have just walked up these stairs. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Cooldowns are there to serve as a login reward. Yeah, true. Because you can always just come back, like, even when you're not playing, you just open it up, you know, throw your stuff in your, your rucksack if you got room. And then, you know, go back to whatever you're doing. True nose hair. The Switch probably run it better. There we go. Easy money. 
Oh no, I gotta reload. Oh, another bounty right here. Let's just spam these. Let's get rich. Let's get some fucking money. We can kill this mega bomb sitting right here too. Fuck him. What's up, bitch? Oh, he is pissed at you. Oh, and he's gone. Why does that happen? That's so annoying. That's not even far away from his spawn. He spawns right there. I hate it when that shit happens. It's better when it happens to bounties, because at least you still get the reward for it. Get your money up, not your funny up. This is still such a crazy spawn for a mega bomb. So weird. He is pissed. He is not happy. Whoa, man. Relax. Oh, no ammo? Really? Shit. I'm gonna fuck him up with this still. Eat a dick. Crazy how they disappear on PC, specifically how the PC crashes. True. It's annoying how often it crashes on PC, because it's not like I got some, like, bitch-ass PC. My shit's pretty tanky. This game is just doo-doo cheeks. Oh, look. Ray gun schematic. I don't even know why I grabbed that sigil. I am not going to be using that. Get out of here. I'm going up to this ammo station real quick. Get some decoys and some, you know, ammo. Oh, and there's a uh, mega bomb right here. Fuck it, we'll do a weapon stash. Cause you don't gotta go too far to get it. Check this out. Grab dead shot. Easy. And I'm just gonna throw something in this turret circuit. Let it do the dirty work. Yeah, I've used a lock with this with slugs. It's good as fuck. The haymaker's pretty good with slugs now too. They, like, silently buffed it. I'm just stand right here and the turret will get him. Went back to MW2 and still performs better than MW3 servers. Yeah, I don't know why it's so different. I don't think I crashed as often in MW2. Either I'm not remembering. I still prefer this game, even with the crashes. Those next open lobbies? Um, I don't know. I'll probably do a stream sometime, uh, either next week or the week after I'm just going for some bioluminescent weapons would you guys be down to do like a multiplayer open lobby stream so i got a, like a decent amount of multiplayer weapons to get done and i don't really know how to put it into a video because like i'm not gonna be like oh this gun's like op or like this gun's like really good because me using it in multiplayer i ain't gonna prove nothing to nobody and it's not like uh anyone cares about seeing like priceless or interstellar because everybody who wants, like, wants it already has it.
The frames drop every now and then. Rip. Revisit transit. It'd be fun to play transit with people, but that map is just so like... It takes so frustratingly long to get set up on it. It's annoying. Uh, any more bounties? There is. I love doing bounties. Fuck it, I'll throw a brain rod on this. Oh, there's another one closer. Good looks. How much longer you plan on streaming for? Um, depending whether or not I get the legendary aether tool from this. We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling after we, we fight the worm again. Because if we fight the worm here and we get the legendary aether tool, then I'm going to call it. But if we don't, uh, we'll, we'll see how, how I'm feeling. Because I still got to record and edit a video after this. So I don't know if I want to be streaming too late. Because then I'll just be up the entire night. Did you moan on the transit video? I probably did. I wouldn't put it past me. I'd be moaning sometimes. You think metaphor cheats? I don't know who that is. But I am like into the whole hacker hunter scene. I do not care. You think of them not having no plans for new perks? I mean, it's disappointing, but I'm not surprised. I would have thought, like, since, uh, what was it? Like, the collector's edition of this game had the Widow's Wine, like, sticker or whatever with it. I thought for sure we'd be getting it in the game, but apparently not. Oh, no, I self revive. Cool. Let's go kill this guy. Fuck him. Oh, Warzone number one player on PC's metaphor? Oh. I don't really keep up with, like, COD scene. I don't really watch, like, a whole lot of COD content. Like, I'll watch some stuff from, like, people I know, like, personally. But I, I just, like, I play the game all day, you know? I'm not trying to, like, watch it all day as well. There's some people that are, like, pretty crazy into, like, the whole hacker hunter scene. And they'll say anybody's and everybody's hacking. You know, it's kind of tiring. Activision, try not to disappoint people challenge. Impossible. Oh, go practice for concert, dude. Get them reps in, nose hair. Alright, see you, cooler. Thanks for stopping by, dude. Thanks for coming and chilling. Haymaker, Haymaker's amazing against the Red Worm, really? I didn't think I'd ever hear that, or see the day where I'd see that in a sentence. Y'all didn't have any thoughts about uh, multiplayer open lobbies? You are about to meet one of most Where's this dude at? Is he up here? Nope. Oh, there he is. He was not right there a second ago. That's for sure. What? No ammo. Another self revive. Rip double tap. It would have been nice in this game, but it would have been so overkill, I think. With all the weapon upgrades and stuff, well, I don't really think you need it. It would be fun, though. Like, don't get me wrong. I'd be so with getting a new perk. That's a bit overkill. Also, I'm taking this uh, flying thing over there. 
Multiplayer open lives go hard? I bet. I might have to do some. I hate this little house right here. I feel like it's a death trap. And they always got one of these bad boys that I have to stop and loot. So I, I have little rat brain. I see cheese, I grab cheese. Maybe they meant nothing new that would be unique to Mar- They said no- They said no like additional perks or no additional enemy types will be added to the game. Very wishful thinking though. I feel like if they could get a win with the community, they would say like, yeah, we got this plan. They wouldn't be like, uh, yeah, no new perks, but we're getting old ones. So I could very easily just be like, yeah, we're getting, we're, you guys are getting some new shit. And everyone would be like, oh, sweet. There's a whole lot of the zombies community is mad at them. I still have no ammo. I'm gonna go grab some. Any way to get Elder Sigils? I'm pretty sure you can only get them in the Dark Aether. I don't know if that's 100% uh, true, but... I feel like I've only seen them in the Dark Aether. What's up? Backslash- or forward slash forward- Forward slash- O, forward slash, backslash, O, backslash. That one was a doozy to try to say. Oh, let's go. Hey, um, what do I need to buy? I got all my perks, right? Is there anything else I need to buy? Or self revives is good. I'm scared to buy turrets again because I will feel like I I feel like I'm gonna crash. Turrets are are bad luck. There's something I'm missing. You can get a sigil by doing yeah. You can get sigils from doing the tier three contracts, but I don't think you can get elder sigils unless you're in the dark aether. Oh shit. We're just cleaning these tier 3 contracts. There's a rumor that Holdout from Outbreak is coming up. We already kind of have that. That's the, the Outlast contracts are basically Holdout. They're like the same thing, really. Except that it doesn't like teleport you to an area and lock you in. I don't think we're going to get any new contracts. I feel like we're going to get, like, different Dark Aether Rifts, and that's going to be it. Get out of the house! Come outside! That car beam right there is so clutch, with this alarm going off. Free decoy. Ooh, hold on. Don't want that blowing up on me. Oh, legendary Aether Tool. Let's go. Some good shit. I will take this over one of these. Ow. Oh, I already got dead shot. I appreciate it. Appreciate the offer. Am I missing a perk? Might as well just go to the Wonder Fizz just to see. Because I always feel like, oh yeah, I got them all. And then someone's like, well, actually... You don't got this one. So let me go see. No, I do got everything. I have a durable gas mask. 
Got a good amount of self revives. There ain't really anything else we need besides uh, the storm to start moving in. So we get a new contract this season, really? Did they? I remember that. I'd be down for it. I'd love to get a new contract. You're just stacking cash, though. I'm using this turret circuit right now. Put it! There we go. Damn, dude. I don't know how I didn't die right there. I was literally just standing still. Ain't getting nothing new but a patch for the tombstone. Yeah, that's what they're gonna prioritize. Hostage rescue contract. That'd be kind of fun. As long as I can have like have a pistol out while holding a hostage, like while carrying them. Yeah, a couple cashmere's. We don't really need. Oh, I guess I could. If we're looking for something to spend money on. You're right. Yeah, I agree. It is, it's upsetting that we're not getting a whole lot of support for it, but... I was uh, very pleasantly surprised. How did I get my tax stance kills done right there without even shooting anything? But I was very pleasantly surprised that, uh, like, with how much I like this mode. I didn't think I'd like it that much. And I hope they just kind of, like, continue to build on this kind of mode in the future. In addition to round base, not as, like, a, a substitute or to replace it. Call me Jay Schlong. That's crazy. Should I have Blight Fathers? That'd be cool. They ain't adding shit. We ain't getting nothing. Running a circle challenge. That's another contract down. Nothing good from it though. I guess I can... No. Sentry gun's bad luck. I ain't touching it. Give me that. The R11 is not that accurate hip firing. Oh, look at all these self revives. Damn. I got scared for a second not seeing all four USBs in my inventory. I forgot he had the other two. I was like, holy shit, did I switch these out? What'd you pin that for? Is there something good over there? What do you see?
Damn, you think we would get like more legendary aether tools or more like tier three crystals or pack three crystals with all these uh, events we've done. We've been doing tier three contracts this whole game. I guess we got one legendary aether tool, but you think we get a little bit more. Bro, whoa, absolute. Tell me about it. Someone's saying help in chat. Where? We're on our way. We have to go rescue somebody, Panda. As long as they tell us where they're at. I'm trying to see if there's a dude on the map that's not moving. Might be this guy. F6. Look at me. I sniffed him out. F6. Buddy. Oh, that is him. I was about to say, do you know where you are? I don't know where I am. What's up, Stir... 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 Rex? Stir... Stir... Tex? Dirt Tex? Do I even know where the fight's gonna be for this worm? Okay, Storm's way over here. Damn. That's an... That's an unfortunate placement. Blood burner's right there. I don't need it. VR 11's fast as fuck. This guy's gonna beat me over to this guy. Oh, he just left the game? I oh, know, he's pleading for help. I am blind. Solo isn't as hard as you think. Yeah, we, we beat it last game. I'm just doing it again to see if I can get the legendary Aether Tool schematic. Another person pleading for help. I'll get the other one. Let me be a hero. Oh, you got him. I'll defend. Switch weapons, please. Jeez. Alright, now back to our contract. Damn, there's a lot of fucking zombies over here. What happened? That was name was Sem Semtex. I used to call them, and I would get fried for this in the comics. I say Stemtex. I thought that's what they were called, like, my whole life. I know a Semtex. What's up, Jaden? Get the ray gun schematic from an Outlast contract, your first time in tier 3? Hell yeah, dude. I got pretty lucky with mine, too. I did a, a tier 3 bounty, and I thought I just had to kill a Mega Abomination tier 3 bounty for it. And I got my, my first try looking for it. I was like, oh shit. I, I thought that was just the way you do it. I just got super lucky. I'm sticky left nut. Call me sticky left nut the way I'm glued to the leg. There's a bar in there somewhere. Somebody will figure it out. This guy's down again. But where? He said my friend is an asshole. What's up, Kaden? Are you gonna go heal him? Good looks. I'll finish the contract. Get that passive income, King. Why is this disciple so beefy? Die. There you go. It's G Money After Hours. We are on kind of late. 
I'm out here bowling. Alright, good night, Noah's here. Have a good one, man. Thanks for coming and showing. Being a hero is my job. I respect it. We got seven minutes. What can we do? More bounties. That's what we can do. Remind me to go to the shop before, like, the storm starts coming in. Like, if I'm near one, just yell at me. So I'll, I'll just fill up some cashmere, so I'll drop this epic aether tool. I don't give a heck. Or a frick. What if I did that? What if I switched on a dime and stopped, like, cussing like a sailor, and I just said, like, heck and frick. And darn and gosh. And dang. If I was throwing in all, like, the... The middle school, like, teacher curse words. Would you guys think any less of me? Hot dang. Oh, golly gee willikers. I do say dumb shit like that, like the, the kind of outlandish ones. The ones that just sound dumb. Those ones are funny. Frick dang it. Damn, this mega bomb's going crazy on the hellhound. Busting his shit open. Dang nabbit. You say the best ability? Like Frenzy Guard? What do you mean like Frenzy Guard? Oh, the best like field upgrade? I always run like Frenzy Guard or like Aether Shroud. I don't run Frenzy Guard if I'm uh... Oh shit, I don't need those. Appreciate them. I don't want to run Frenzy Guard if I have golden plates or if I'm just setting up a tombstone because if you don't have any armor anyways, Frenzy Guard don't help out too much. I just like it to refill my armor when I need it. But Aether Shroud is really good for like an oh shit button, but it don't work on mercs. Energy Mine is actually really good in this, like if you're going against like a, a horde of zombies. It's pretty fun to use. Really good for XP too. Go for some McNuggets right now. I could go for some too. Give me some sweet and sour sauce. Do ever go back to playing Cold War? Probably not for a bit. I think I'm probably going to play it closer to the next Black Ops game. Like when that releases. A little bit before that. Probably will play it on 420 as well. For the, our high, how high of a round can we get. Stream. And um... Outside of that. Probably not too much. Like I'm not going to go for Dark Aether again. I might do some like high round streams to try to get up to our million kills. But I played that game last like three years. There ain't really a whole lot more I can do in it. You know, I, I want to give it some time away. So I can come back and have some more fun with it. You know, give me some time to forget about things. So that way when I come back, it's like a brand new game or it feels more nostalgic. Is there any ammo on the ground? There is. Give me that. Tesla Storm. Tesla Storm was a lot better in Cold War. I, it's still like decent in this, but I haven't really ran it. Tesla Storm was my go-to in Cold War for like uh, Outlet or like Onslaught. Outbreak. Damn. Third, third tries the charm or whatever the fuck the saying is. Third time's the charm. I, I'm stumbling and tripping and falling over my words. But I, I would also use that too if I didn't like want to use Ring of Fire or like I'd use it early game in Cold War. Also, thank you for pinging the shop. I would have forgot. 
But I, I would use it like early game on like Cold War until like I got set up, then I switched to Ring of Fire. A wick. Wick Donalds? Well, they got a new sauce? How did I not hear about this? You know what the next COD is? Everyone's saying it's it's gonna be Cold or Golf War, but it's gonna be Treyarch's next like Black Ops game. We don't know like all the details on it. They have nothing's been officially announced. Ugh. But everyone's assuming that it's gonna be called Golf War. Damn, dude. Out of ammo again. Zombies, get the drop in some. I wish I could buy like a munition box or something. Oh wait, that's a tier two shop. There's gotta be a tier three shop over here. I'm going to this one. Cause I wanna buy cashmere's. I was thinking you ping the shop that normally spawns here. My bad, I kinda just walked away while you're fighting it. I know you can handle them. I got a little distracted. You know, if it's going to have zombies, if Treyarch makes a game and it doesn't have zombies, the world's ending. I just want you to know that. I'm assuming it's going to have zombies. There's a pretty good chance it will. But now that you said that, you might have just jinxed it. Two minute warning. Appreciate you. We got to buy these cashmere's and we got to go. I'm dropping this epic aether tool right now. Let me make sure that I don't lose my uh, decoys either. So when I buy these cashmere's, I don't want to it like to auto equip them. Micro tra micro transaction PVP. Also, would not surprise me. Uh, I did drop the decoys. Equip those. Stow those. Alright, we're good. Let's go. Mimic! I'm looking at my map, bro. Leave me alone. Pre-ordering next game the moment it's announced. I probably will as well. But I kind of have to. Part of the job. At least, like, we're not wasting too much time because the storm is going to take a second to get there. You don't got to count down in chat, please. You don't got to put every single second in chat. That's just uh, annoying when you spam it like that. Yeah, I, I Galaxy, I, I, or Galaxy, and I'm just calling Galaxy, it's easier for me. But, um, I, I really hope it's like Cold War zombies as well. It would suck if it wasn't. If it was nothing like Cold War, I wouldn't know, uh... I don't know how I'd feel. I, I at least hope it's good. That's all I hope. This is Alpha. Which ones do I have? Delta and Charlie. Charlie. So this one is Delta... And this one is Charlie. Yeah, so I get these two. These two bad boys. Don't forget to have one person put in all the USBs, really? Only one person can do it? Why? You got a toothache? I'm sorry, dude. The teeth pain is terrible. Not to be confused with T-Pain. T-Pain's sweet. 
Like, what happens if we both just put in the different USBs? Do we all have to, do I, like, one person has to put them all in? What happens if we don't? Oh, get fucked up. You got tax stance headshotted from all the way over here. No way these guys think they can f come fuck with us. You started this battle. We don't need you coming down here. You don't want to fuck with this worm? Oh, this is dumb. They are unloading on us. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh, well, the storm's about to fucking devour them. Enjoy that shit. So, nothing bad will happen? No, everyone can put in the USPs? Okay. Supposedly the worm is easier? Oh, well, whatever. I don't care about easy. I'm gonna fuck them up regardless. The worm should worry about us being easier. He's got us to worry about. Test which burst weapons are good and the Lamas is good. Burst weapons usually are pretty good in zombies. Like the, the M16 in Cold War was like meta. There we go. I think that's a new worm, but much harder. Worm harder and uncut. They give us an uncircumcised, or a, a, yeah, an uncircumcised worm. Honestly, if they throw in another worm, I kind of respect it, because that's just fucking absurd. It's so ridiculous. We don't need another fucking worm. And if they put it in here, it better be like a different color. Like we, we should have purple worm, red worm, and then like give us like green worm or something. Like it, of course I wouldn't like it. I'd be disappointed, but it'd be kind of funny. Like you can't lie. Them putting in a, another worm, a fourth worm would be hilarious. Oh, we're all up in a shit. In the worm guts. You better drop me a legendary aether tool. Oh, what the fuck? Damn. He even, like, used the laser the whole last time we fought him. Gotcha. The pink worm? Uh, actually, yeah. Pink worm would look pretty cool. I'd take that over green worm. Because if it's a pink worm, then it's like the Alaskan bull worm. We should get like uh, an ultra abomination instead of a mega. And it's just like, a, like slightly bigger. Or we should get a mini abomination where it's tiny. Like it's a uh, like crawler sized. Yeah, this VR11 just fucks it. The worm has no chance. Yeah, you heard that right, worm. You can try to bite me all you want. Bitch ass worm. Going down. Elemental worm. That'd be cool. But honestly, I'm. I'll take whatever. Better than nothing added in, I guess. Bye, bitch! Where's my schematic? I don't even have to use these cashmeres. I'll use them now. No! I got the Scorcher schematic if you want it. If you got the Legendary Aether tool. And you don't already have that one. I will happily take it. Damn. Why is this the one schematic that has evaded me? 
How many times I gotta kill this thing? Whatever, I'll take it with me for XP. I'll take this too. Oh, there goes my gas mask. Well, it's been an honor, Panda. I'm out of here. Can't say no to that or dussy. That's true. It would have been nice to have Orda in this. Oh, thanks, Luke. I am well. Mason or the Ordussy? I do really like that Mason operator skin. That'll be tough. Giant Abomination that has Mimic sticking out of it? That'd be fun. Two worms? The dueling... What if the worm was double-sided? If one, one side went down and the other side was also worm. What about that? You get the... Yeah, that's alright. This is gonna elude me for like the rest of my life. It refuses to be unlocked. What's Orda? There's a boss in a Cold War. A big monster. We did 31 contracts and all those were in tier 3. Out of 31 contracts, we came out with this. That's it. That's crazy. But you see we got 4 hours off our insured weapon slot. If we even had one. Kind of nasty. <laughs> Joe, I watched your Garfield video, but you're not Garfield because Garfield is a cat, not a human. Astute observation. I love shit like that. That's like what, what you see of like all the Breaking Bad memes. They're like, why didn't Jimmy just do this? Is he stupid? Three-headed worm. Oh yeah, like a mega bomb with worm heads. That'd be cool. Oh, we got four hours off our insured weapon slot time, but we didn't lose our insured weapon slot until we left the game without our weapon. I love how this game works. <sighs> Is there any new schematics coming with season two reloaded? We're getting the mags of holding, which is um like basically ring of fire, but it doesn't add it bonus damage. It just takes uh, bullets out of your stock. And then we got the scorcher schematic or not the scorcher the um blood burner i think there's another one that i'm forgetting yeah i don't remember best gun for tier three the lockwood 680 is really good the haymaker with slugs has been very good so use both those shotguns with slugs um the ram 9 has been good i've been using that a lot today what else uh, akimbo swarm, swarms are good. Tears can be good. I don't know. Oh, your Ram 9 Golden Enigma got fixed? Let's go. Oh, yeah, VR 11 schematic. True. That'll be nice. I have one more VR 11 left if I want to do the worm again another time. That's so crazy how I haven't gotten that schematic yet. I've beaten the worm so many times. I've been up beating my worm forever. Let me put this bad boy away. Well, do you guys want to see the lightsaber? This is probably going to be the end of the stream, but I got one last little gift for you guys. Yeah, I got the black cell. I always get the black cell. Mainly because this is what I do for my job. But honestly, the black cell operators are kind of mid. I, I'm over the whole like black and gold thing it's played out but i like the extra rewards and stuff for, like zombies but this might take me a second to put this bad boy together i have to put in like the battery in the middle it's actually pretty cool need the thunder gun in this game that'd be sweet but this comes apart like that now check this out You take this little battery here, the middle. Bam. Let me make sure it's on. Bam. Put this in here. Where is it? Oh, wait, there we go. Put this bad boy on. Screw it in. There's a theory that John Doe is soap because of his description. I haven't even looked. 
Let me let me see. Let me look at his subscription or his description. Oh, let me go to um my multiplayer so I can see it. Yeah, me too, legendary. I was hoping I would I would get one too. Especially since it's in your name. You think they'd give it to you. Let me see. Where's John Doe? How do I see his customize? Bound to an internal cycle of war, some souls can never find peace. What does that got to do with price? I do got the Dark Aether Bunny plush. Pretty cool. Mr. Peaks is like a really cool design. But this is the blade for it. Now check this out. Put this in here. And I have to screw it in. This is the only like bad thing about it. Like you can't put the blade and just like store it inside of it. Which sucks. It's not like those, uh, the old toys that you would use where it, it would all just like collapse inside of it. You know, for convenience, but this ain't like bad. Just wait till you guys see what it looks like. Shit, I just like dropped the screw. It's a very small screw. Oh, no, we're good. I got it. This is my lap. Now we screw this bad boy in. And we're gonna nerd out for a second. Yeah, the one that you would like flick out. That's like the only downside to this. And now to really see it. I gotta turn off all these lights. There's all the background lights. Let me turn off my key lights. Very dark. Now let me turn this on. And there's an app for it. Let me make sure it's on the right color. Let's connect to it. App connected. connected. Saw Mr. Peaks move behind you? No, you did not. Relax. Let me make sure I'm on the right one. We'll put it to this. Now check this shit out. Ready? You guys aren't ready for this. Ready? Look at that. Isn't that crazy? Hold on, let me zoom the camera out. Look at this shit. And the, the coolest part about it is that it's got like motion gestures. Where I can do this. Wait. Sometimes a little finicky. It goes away like that. I can twist it right back on. And then, hold on. If I hit this, it does like the, the blaster deflection, which is sweet. It can also do like the, the, like the torch thing where you're like putting it into whatever, like cutting a door open or some shit. It's got the sound to it. My mic don't pick it up very well. Ooh. I just hit the ceiling fan. This is not like the best room to do this in. But I want to like learn tricks and shit with it. I don't know anything yet. But yeah, I can be like... Fuck. I'm so scared I'm going to break this in here. But it's got all the sounds. And then also... Oh wait, did it just turn off? The battery die on it? Yeah, the battery just fucking died on it. There we go. Go oh, check this shit out.
Let's go to... There's a Darth Vader one that we can put on this. Look at this. Check this out. Ready? All red. Pretty fucking sweet. Isn't that fucking fire? Oh. I should have been charging it this whole time. But yeah. This is what I'm, uh... This is where I... I, I make very good financial decisions. Is getting shit like this. Now hold on. There's gotta be one more cool saber we can do. Let's see. Fallen Apprentice Magenta. Fallen Apprentice Magenta. You can't really see it too well, but this is like a, a nice light purple. Pretty sweet. And it just keeps turning off. Yeah, I should have been charging it. Hold on, let's see if we can squeeze another one in. That's not connected. Damn. But yeah, this is what I, I got for myself on my birthday. And it took over a month for it to get sent out here. So they like custom make these like one by one. Like per order. I was pretty hyped about it. So, number, pick a number between 1 and 34, and I'll show you what that lightsaber is, because it comes with 34, like, presets, and you can download, like, other ones, and get, like, different, like, sound effects for specific, uh, like, Jedi or whatever. It's a background prop right off. You guys are smart. I should do that. But pick a number 1 through 34. First one I see, I'll, I'll do. Show us your hanging saber. Bro, relax. Relax. Oh, this one's the rainbow. Just kind of shows like the light in it. Cause it's not like, it's not like base lit. So it's not like the lights coming from like inside of the, the hilt. There's lights all throughout the like beam for it. What was the first number I saw? 34.5, good one. We'll do nine. Nine's the first one I saw that's we can actually do. Does this shit turn off again? Bro. Hold a charge challenge. Oh, 26 too. That's the no-brainer. We'll do nine and then 26 and I'm gonna get out of here. So this is number nine. It's called the sun, I think. Wait, ready? The sun. The sun. So I'm pretty sure this one's Luke's. Yeah, this one's Luke's. That nice green dude? Are you kidding me? Clean. It's got a, a little bit different of a sound to it too. It also has like the flash on clash. And you hit against my hand. Oh. Okay. And then we'll do 26 and that'll be it. Alright, see a killer. It's stunned by, dude. I'm getting out of here in a second as well. I just wanted to nerd out a little bit at the end. Yoda stick. I have, like, a, a Yoda saber that I had from when I was a kid. Like, my mom thought Yoda was cute, so she would give me Yoda stuff. So I have, like, a replica Yoda saber. It's nothing like this one, but it's still pretty cool. What's 26? This one is idle. I don't know what the fuck that is, but we'll see. Oh, this one's all white and it has like a sword sound. Right. Listen to this one. Sounds a little different. Pretty sure it's supposed to be like Knights of the Old Republic or something. Yeah, but this shit's dead. I'm dead. I need to go record and edit, but appreciate you guys coming and chilling. And uh, watching me nerd out a little bit. The rainbow is Meek Mill Saber. <laughs> Relax, dude. That's ridiculous. But they stop. Oh, wait, purple? Fine. I can show purple. Unless it's dead. Let's do a quick purple. 
Let's um set it there. That's it doesn't really it shows up more white on the camera, but this is like pure purple. And now it's dead. I can basically like change whatever color I want on it. It's sweet. But yeah, just wanted to nerd out a little bit, show you guys this, because I don't know, it's cool. But thanks for stopping by, guys.